Fortenberry, who ran a little railroad cafe out in Irondale, Alabama. And it was about, really, my family. And um, that was a special, special book for me because they made the film. And once they made the film, it was very special to me because that film went all over the world. And, and no matter where I go, and if I go to Europe, people say, are people in Alabama really that nice and that sweet? And, I don't know so <laughs> and uh, you'd be surprised what they uh, passed the fried green tomatoes. <laughs>
And so I thought, I want to take the, those things out of that shoebox and bring them back to life, the cafe back to life, the house back to life, and that period back to life of the 30s. And I thought, she wants me. She wanted me to write about that because she left it to me. And so that's how I did that book. Well, what cut to about four years ago, I was wanting to come up with, with another book, and I thought, oh, that book, those, those girls that flew in the Second World War. And I went into uh, my library, and I picked up this book, and I, when I first looked at it, I didn't see the first page. I flipped through to the pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Well, 